To install your signature on MacMail, click on Install eSig, and we want to download Method 3. So we want to go ahead and save this file on your computer to access. We can go ahead and save it to our Downloads folder, and then we're going to go over to MacMail. We're going to go to our Mail Preferences. We're going to go over to Signatures, and we want to add a new signature. We'll call this our eSig. We want to drag our eSig into the email account we want the signature to appear. And then we'll choose that as our default. We want to make sure that it's above quoted text. And we'll exit out of MacMail. Now we want to open the eSig file that we just downloaded in Safari. It's very important that you only open this in Safari. Then what we want to do is navigate to File, Save As, and we want to overwrite the file we just created in the Mac mail. So we're going to navigate to our home folder, Library. We're going to find Mail, and then Signatures. Now in the Signatures folder, we want to look for the web archive file that we just created by sorting by date modified. And you'll see the one we just created a couple minutes ago right there. We want to click it to overwrite the file name once. And we want to go ahead and save. Yes, we want to replace. Now we can quit Safari, relaunch mail, and compose a new message. And your signature should appear. You can also control your signature by clicking None or selecting back to your eSig at any time.